Hey Joe. Yes, sir. Uh, question for you. Uh, I'm up here in the Pacific Northwest, and I think a lot of other places on those masonry assemblies are also including like a water repellent on the outside to help. I know it's not the answer by any means, but what are your thoughts on is that? I don't. I don't. I don't have an issue with water repellents, um, um, but understand they they're only good for about 10 years because they break down because of ultraviolet light. And architects are not happy with them because they change the sheen. They change the, 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 the look, okay? And, and um, the stuff that we have today for the water repellents are a huge improvement than the stuff we had 30 years ago. Um, silicon as a water repellent was a, a disaster on brick in the old days because the water would be trapped inboard and we'd have tremendous spalling and efflorescence. So the silicones, you, 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 would, you, would, you would never put silicone on brick because it trapped too much water. It repelled water, but some of it got in and it couldn't get out and it was a, a disaster. So the silicones were changed to silanes and siloxanes. And the silanes and siloxanes are, 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 are quite spectacular. And silanes and siloxanes um, are less UV sensitive than the normal water repellents, but are uh, more expensive. So silane and siloxane, uh, understand that it's going to change the sheen, but it's not going to win the fight, all right? It's going to help you. You still need the flashing. You still need the drainage. You still need all of that other stuff. Um, sometimes when, the, when there's a, the building is experiencing some distress, but it's not a total failure, sometimes that'll buy you enough to give you 10 years, right? In other words, if, if it gives me another 5% and all I need is that extra 5%, I'll go there. I wouldn't rely it on new construction, but it might be, the, might be one of the most affordable options that I have because we're in the middle of a bad situation and we don't have unlimited funds. Sometimes it gets me there. Now, the words I use is sometimes it gets us there. Well, we want you to guarantee this. Well, you know, if you want to guarantee it, you're going to have to go to the everything. On the other hand, let's give it a try and see what happens. And um, it's important when you do that not to have assets and insurance.